Greetings YouTube. Today's video is a bit of a gear disappointment as well as a gear tip video. First of all, the disappointment. These are my new Chippewas. I've talked about them in a video before. And at the time of this recording, I have been wearing them consistently for three months straight every day at work. And I've been working six days a week. And uh, the other day, the laces broke. Now, I understand that shoelaces or boot laces are not supposed to last forever. I get that. 100%. I don't expect them to, but three months, not even six, that's that's unreasonable in my opinion, completely unreasonable in my opinion. Um, so I was leaving for work when this happened, of course, because I almost only wear them at work. Um, and so I had to, like in a six minute time span with my wife's assistance, I had to find new laces, which I don't have in the house. I don't have spare laces lying around, but what I do have is paracord quite a bit of paracord and the closest spool to me when this happened was this stuff this orange paracord so i now have orange laces on my boots now it is actually my tradition that once i have a pair of boot laces or shoelaces give out i will replace them with paracord um, in the case of boots i just use standard paracord uh, my old boots which i currently use as my uh cold weather shop shoes um they have uh black paracord laces on them and uh i actually recently did get some black paracord but it was in storage but this was lying on the floor because it's going to eventually be in a gear video in a in a bargain video i just haven't really been gotten many bargains lately um and uh so i had would have replaced this these old laces with Par paracord eventually anyway i just don't know if i would have picked this color i'm not going to care i'll wear it it's, a, it's different you know what the heck um and i like about it because it's incredibly durable the paracord laces i have in my old boots which i have i wore every day for five years uh, those laces are four years old and they still perform flawlessly now when i tend to replace the laces in hiking shoes um like i have an old pair of light hikers they're a pair of keens and those are my shop shoes for the warmer weather um because i don't really care what happens to them i don't want to use my good hiking shoes my good light hikers which i actually go and use in the cool and warmer weather and i actually go and hike with them occasionally um i replaced those with paracord but i took the innards out so it's just the flat casing of the uh um paracord and it's still incredibly strong far stronger than any pair of uh shoelaces you're ever going to buy um and that makes it flatter because you're flatter profile it's easier to get through a smaller hole um so it's i think it's a, a little better for, for a lighter shoe and the nice thing about this is if you really want to you're now carrying seven strands these are i think 72 inches long so you're carrying i'm carrying now 12 feet of cordage in my boots because you can snip the ends off these things pull out the cordage the casings will still operate as your boot laces and you now have cordage which is far stronger than anything you're going to be able to scavenge in a situation where you might need cordage um the only thing i have only problem with paracord is you really have to make sure you melt the ends thoroughly because if you don't the casing will slide off of the innards. So you really have to make sure you want to get you you melt those ends successfully and you squeeze you know squeeze the ends flat. They can kind of make them a little tubular, pointy. It's easier to get them through the little holes if they're not flat as but if they're if they're cylindrical shape as opposed to flat. Um, but yeah, I'm a big proponent of replacing boot laces or even you know shoe laces with paracord. And you do have colored options. Then there are lots of different colored options out there for um, paracord so you could be very creative if you want to you, you could get anything you want um maybe i'll do purple next time who knows you can get purple paracord i don't think i have any but you can get it um and it, you would make very unique and unusual laces uh, and very durable so uh, has anyone out there ever used paracord as a uh, lacing material um i find it to be incredibly um strong uh readily available um works perfectly and it's a, it's a really fast, easy fix, and it's going to make sure you're not going to have to buy boot laces for a heck of a long time. 